I'm just so glad it's over. It was Relief that winter may finally be behind us. Well, it's uh, really nice out today, that's for sure. As people head outside for some spring fun. And others get ready for some spring yard work. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. Those leaf blowers are out and the grass is starting to turn green. Hard to believe it, but today's weather may also have some people thinking about planting season. Fox 11's Gabrielle Mays shows us what people are doing to prepare for what's been a late start to spring. Tom Wojcik's yard work is just beginning, but he's got it all planned out. Well, we're gonna, first we're going to rake up the leaves, pick them up with a sweeper. Then we're going to take a thatcher, go over the whole yard, and then wait for the people to come and fertilize the lawn, and then we watch the grass grow. Wojcik isn't the only one prepping his lawn, which is keeping Kemp's Ace Hardware busy. Everything is at once. It's uh, You don't have that spacing out where you can really um, take your time with the people and everything. It's like a, it's a mad rush. Kemp says a lot of customers are dusting off their lawn mowers and bringing them in for maintenance. Right now, his shop is repairing 100 mowers a week. Usually, they pull them out. They they have to mow with them to find out that they're not in good shape. If you want to plant this season and you're like me, you don't have a green thumb, you'll want to pick a plant with much thicker leaves. That's because they retain water. But you'll have to wait until temperatures rise because it's still a little too cold for them to be outside. Mayflower greenhouse workers say the first few weeks of spring haven't made it easy for the growing season. The shipment of the plants were delayed because of the cold, cold temperatures outside and uh, when they shipped the plants uh, quite often they came frozen so we had some losses. I just put them out. Those today. delays are keeping production manager Yanis Guzma busy. We have to do the double work on you know, the certain days and then uh, to kind of force it to grow, we are raising the temperature and uh, feeding the uh, plants with, with more nutrients. Kusma says if you really want to add some color to your yard, you can put some plants in a hanging basket, but you'll have to bring it inside at night to keep the plants warm. Up to like uh, lower 20s. In Hobart, Gabrielle Mays, Fox 11 News. Kusma says hardy annuals like pansies and violas can survive the colder temperatures at night, but planting season is still a few weeks away.